Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I am going to get a quick message out for you guys. So if you like the message or if it resonates with you, give this video a thumbs up. So let's get into the message y'all. Right. Let's see. We got the nine of cups coming out first. Okay, we got some emotions. We got the King of Swords in the reverse. We got the Eight of Pentacles. We got the King of Cups. We got the Queen of Wands. And we got the Lover's card coming out, Sun at the bottom of the deck. Hmm. So, we got the King of Swords in the reverse out here. This is somebody that's very manipulative. This is basically my narcissist card. Um, so, you have somebody that has feelings for you. Oh. They see you as this um, Queen of Wands energy. Queen of Wands energy is somebody that's confident, independent, very attractive as well. Um, they are viewing you as their wish fulfillment. Um, I feel like they want to work on that. Um, this person can't could have been very manipulative as well, or could be manipulative, but come off as they ha they have their emotions intact as well. Um, with the sun being at the bottom of the deck, it's like they are wanting to work on something. But we're going to get into the message. We're going to see what comes out. Why the nine of cups? Okay. We got the six of swords. Okay. Why the six of swords? We got the ten of swords. Okay. Okay, what's the ten of swords? And the six of swords. We got the page of swords. Oh my gosh. So somebody could have walked away from you. Um, it could have been a painful ending. You could have viewed it as a painful ending, but this person is watching you. What's the page of swords? What's the page of swords? We got the three of pentacles. What's the three of pentacles? What's the three of pentacles? Okay. What's the three of pentacles? We got the fool. And what's the fool? We got the seven of pentacles. Three of cups at the bottom of the pig. Okay. <clears throat> so this person could have walked away from you and invested with a third party or something like that. Um, they could have worked with a third party, took some sort of leap of faith in a different direction. And it's like, it's kind of giving me that they're not, they're, whatever they're invested in, they're kind of waiting on the investment. And it's, it's giving me that it's not going to work out like they planned it to. What's the seven of pentacles? We got the hangman. It's like they, they're kind of stuck in something that they invested in. They 
kind of walked away from someone they viewed as wish fulfillment and this could have went towards they could have walked away from with the devil at the bottom of the day they could have walked into like something toxic something codependent it's giving me somebody was very codependent on someone and they chose that person that was that were codependent on them um it's also giving me that they chose like appearances uh superficial reasons or whatever the case may be they chose to go towards that person when maybe you were the one giving them they viewed you as wish fulfillment you know giving them love authentic authentic love um genuine love <clears throat> but it seems like they pick someone over that maybe money appearances superficial reasons um things of that nature and kind of got themselves stuck is what i'm getting why the king of swords and the reverse we got the hermit in the reverse okay so somebody this manipulative person um king of swords in the reverse they refuse to go within they refused to, refuse to work on themselves with with the tower at the bottom of the deck. What's the hermit? Okay. We got the six of cups. What's the six of cups? We got the nine of pentacles. So this person views you as financially stable. Um very abundant um this could have been somebody from your past as well um what's the nine of pentacles we got the nine of wands and what's the nine of wands we got the ten of wands and the magician okay we got the two of cups at the bottom of the deck so this is somebody you could have been in a relationship with of course um with the nine of wands and the ten of wands it's like they try to like throw burdens your way um but you press you, you persevered through that like you got through the burdens you got through all of that and you could be manifesting you could be a master manifester as well what's the magician we got the two of pentacles and what's the two of pentacles we got the devil with the will of fortune at the bottom of the day. What's the devil? We got the ace of pentacles, but that came out on the fence. So this person was kind of like, yeah, yeah, with the two of swords at the bottom of the day. This person was like kind of juggling whether they should invest in you or invest in something else that they knew that was toxic like they knew that this way was toxic but i feel like with the ace of pentacles coming out crossing um they they wanted to go towards what they knew was toxic because they felt like it was a financial opportunity however in the reverse as well they knew that they would be missing an opportunity so this person like didn't know which way to go so they picked what they was used to basically is what i'm saying which is toxicity codependency addictions things of that nature What's the Ace of Pentacles? Then I'm going to move on. What's the Ace of Pentacles in the struggle position? We got the um, Knight of Wands. Somebody that was very impulsive, uh, made impulsive decisions, didn't think, you know, with the King of Wands at the bottom. They just thought they, they were this leader. They thought they were going in the right direction, basically. What's the Eight of Pentacles? What's going on with this Eight of Pentacles? We got the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay, what's the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse? They were working on something. Oh, that was a lot. Let me, yeah, that was a lot of cards that fell. What's the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse? 
We got the Eight of Swords and we got the Higher Frame. What's the Eight of Swords on the Higher Frame? What's the Eight of Swords on the Higher Frame? It's the Judgment. So it's like this person was working on with the five of cups at the bottom of the deck, this person is in regret. Like whatever decision they made, whatever they went towards, they are in regret about it. Um, I feel like this person is working on not being non-committal um, because they feel like it's just really only getting them stuck in their head, you know, getting them trapped um, and, and trapping themselves. Basically, um, I feel like they're being guided to work on that about themselves with the eight of with the higher friend and the judgment being here. I feel like that they are trying to work on that. What's the judgment? Let me see. What's the higher friend and the judgment? We got the eight of wands. I mean, <clears throat> with the justice at the bottom of the deck. It's like, at this point, this person has got themselves in a situation that they have no choice but to work on themselves. What's this King of Cups? <clears throat> we got the Five of Pentacles. What's the Five of Pentacles and the King of Cups? We got the Queen of Pentacles. And what's the point of pentacles? What? What's the queen of pentacles? Oh. We got the chariot. Okay, so <clears throat> this queen of this king of cups and this um, King of Swords in the reverse is giving me the same people. Okay. They come off as this, well, they don't come off. They come off as this person who has their emotions intact, very balanced, um, things of that nature. But this is because it's like they're putting up a facade, but they're really like trying to manipulate, manipula, manipulate you we're coming off with this King of Cups energy, okay? So they were kind of with the death, y'all, at the bottom. They were kind of like manipulating a situation to, I'm not sure, to leave you, leave somebody out in the cold, like financially, like whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, this could be you, um, place the roles as they fit, you know? But they wanted, they knew that this person was, you know, nurturing, um, financially stable. <clears throat> they didn't want this for you with the death. They wanted to break that down. They wanted to take that. What's the chariot? Oh, the emperor in the reverse. Somebody's very manipulative and controlling. Okay. They wanted to control that. What's what's the emperor in reverse? What is going on? Oh, okay. We got the five of cups in the reverse. With the sun at the bottom of the deck. So this person is has some sort of awareness, some sort of sudden awareness. And I want to get to it. What's the five of cups in the reverse? Okay, the Nine of Swords. And what's the Nine of Swords? They got an awareness that they, they're in despair. What's the Nine of Swords? Yeah, they're in despair. Like, by trying to do this to somebody, they are in despair, okay? Like, they kind of did this to themselves. Um, they're very stressed out, they're burnt out as well what's the four swords in the reverse what's the four swords in the reverse yes two of cups very burnt out very 
Oh, gosh. This person is going through it. About a relationship? A partnership? What's the two of cups? What about this partnership? What about this partnership? What's the two of cups? The three of cups. Okay. About a third party. With the strength. They're in despair, stressed out about a third party. Somebody that they picked over you. Mm. What's this queen of wands? Let's move on. What's this queen of wands? Okay, so we got the six of wands. Okay, we got a queen of wands out here. Somebody's very, you know attractive um i believe this queen of pentacles or hold on because with this queen of pentacles here i feel like somebody like came off as they were because i'm getting something else now hold on y'all hold on this person came off like they were financially stable whoever they went towards whoever they pick whoever they whatever they came off like they were financially stable, like they were financially this, like they had it all together and they were, they weren't, they weren't. And now this Queen of Wands is giving me that this Queen of Wands could be you, man or female, take the roles how they fit. There's just no gender in tarot, you know. Um, you're receiving some sort of public uh, recognition. Like you're receiving some sort of success with the Queen of Swords at the bottom of the deck. You could be saying something as well. Um, what's the Six of Wands and the Queen of Wands? We got the Sun. Yeah. Like you're doing it. Like if they wanted you to be down to your knee. Yeah. The Wheel of Fortune. It's, everything is going in your favor. They, somebody wanted you to be down and out and and all of this extra stuff. You're not. You're not. You're not at all. Will of Fortune, and you're not at all. Mm -mm. Will of Fortune, Ten of Pentacles, the star. Okay? You're the star. What's the sign and the Six of Wands? And that's the truth. Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords. Okay. What's this lovers? Okay. So we got the Seven of Wands. What's the Seven of Wands? We got the Queen of Cups in the reverse. Four of Pentacles at the bottom. So, okay. So somebody's holding on to a relationship. Somebody's holding on tightly to a relationship. Okay. It's giving me, what I'm feeling is giving me is this third party. They're holding on because with the Queen of Cups coming out in reverse, this is somebody that's not caring, um, not loving. They may come off as they are, but they're not at all. Um, they're trying to block some sort of connection or something, and they're holding on to a person that probably does not want to be held on to. Okay, what's the Queen of Cups? Let's let's get, let's get this message out. What's the Queen of Cups? We got the Three of Wands. Yeah, Three of Wands, Queen of Swords, like Three of Wands. This is somebody looking ahead. Um, <clears throat> yeah. What what's the Three of Wands? The Page of Cups. They're trying to block somebody from relaying some sort of message to you five of swords and they doing this at all costs y'all i cannot i cannot make this up they are doing everything in their power to keep someone from coming towards you okay what's the page of swords i'm sorry the page of cups the will of fortune yeah they're blocking they're blocking mm. And what's the Will of Fortune? Last few cards, and I'm going to end it, y'all. What's the Will of Fortune? What's 
the Wheel of Fortune. We got the King of Wands. We got the Five of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Like, somebody is going through pure chaos. Like, pure chaos. Trying to block this. What's the King of Wands? We got the Seven of Cups. So, somebody trying to confuse... This person from coming in. Yo, I cannot make this up. Somebody is trying to confuse someone. Okay? What's the seven of cups, y'all? I want to keep going. What's the seven of cups? The moon. With lies. With secrets. With deception. I cannot. King of cups. Somebody want to come, y'all. And somebody is like putting up all types of illusions and confusions to keep this person. Listen, if you got to do all of this to keep a person, they're not for you. That's not your person. What's the moon and the seven of cups? Just in the reading. Ace of cups. From getting them to walk away from them. Stop. I cannot, y'all. From getting them to walk away from them. They are holding on. Oh my goodness, y'all. I cannot. So, y'all, that's going to be y'all reading. I hope the reading did resonate with y'all. Um, like this video if you like my vibe. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if it resonated. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.